morning, everyone. This is Uma coming to you on Saturday with your daily reading for Saturday, January 6th, 2018. It is bitterly cold out here in Virginia. But we will make it through. Okay. So let's get ready to see what the energies are like for today, Saturday, January 6th, 2018. Here we go. We have <clears throat> Two of Earth, Five of Fire, Three of Air. Okay, some really bleak cards. So we're going to talk a little bit about this. <clears throat> and pull some clarifiers. So two of earth talks about too much going on, <clears throat> the need to be more playful, the need to make a decision. So there's a lot of things happening, okay? Maybe you have work to do. Maybe you have personal commitments to attend to. You just have a lot of things going on. And you need to make up your mind, make decisions, be a little bit more proactive today. But in addition to this, we have a lot of conflict. I, sometimes I read this as conflict with others. Today I'm reading this as conflict within yourself. It's like half of you wants to do the work and half of you wants to get all these things accomplished that you have to, but then the other half of you just kind of want to lay in bed and watch TV. So I feel the conflict is there that, you know, competing ideas, competing goals of how you want to spend today, Saturday. And that's coming about because for some of you, you're grieving. There's sadness involved. Right? So three of air for me represents loss or the perception of loss. Because remember, this is an air card. So it could be that there is no loss, that you're just feeling loss and feeling lack. So that's the energies um, as we start out Saturday. Let's see what we get for clarifiers. Ten of fire. Unity. <clears throat> Knight of fire. So the ten of fire explains why you need to make a decision. There's so much going on and... You're not really doing anything, you're stuck because life has been out of balance. You might be sick, you know, stress-related health concerns. You might be um, not well or just handling a lot emotionally, physically, spiritually, mentally, and it's now catching up to you. Okay, so this explains why there's a need to be more playful today. And to just, what I'm feeling is just pick one thing. If you have a list of 10 things, write it out and then pick one thing, the easiest thing to do, and then just do it. <clears throat> the unity card talks about spirituality, mentorship, seeking spiritual community, so this is asking you to turn to spiritual means to address this conflict within you. So whatever it is that you're feeling, meditate. Listen to uplifting videos or affirmations. Listen to positive music. Do whatever you can to shift the vibration, okay, to address the conflict. Or seek out a mentor. Seek out a coach, a life coach. Talk about it. But don't sit in this conflict of this five and fire. <clears throat> The Knight of Fire talks about advanced movements, okay? It says a sudden event that needs immediate attention, time is of the essence, so there's something stressing you out that has some kind of time limit on it, that has some kind of, I feel like it's like a ultimatum attached to it. Maybe you threw down the ultimatum on someone and you're sitting and waiting and that's what the sadness is about because you don't know where it's going to go. 
So there's a lot of chaotic energy today, and there's a lot of energy that's kind of making you feel stuck. You want to move. You, there's a desire to move, but there's no movement. So let's pull your crowning card to a fire. You'll make it out, and you'll possibly make it out with someone else as well. This card talks about coming into your own. It talks about creating partnerships. So whatever it is that you're feeling today, it's a very uncomfortable day, but there's a way out. There is a way out. Okay. All right, let's pull your mantra for today. Gratitude. You fully appreciate the invaluable lessons that life lovingly presents to you. Yeah, I mean, today is not feeling like a good day, guys. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. It's not feeling like a good day, but be grateful. Be grateful for whatever it is that you can be grateful about. Even if it's just something as simple as, I'm grateful I got up today. I'm grateful I'm off today, you know, just whatever it is that you can find to be grateful for, go ahead and be grateful for that. All right, my friends, that is your reading for today, Saturday. Thank you so much. I'll catch you around.